Hello again, everybody, and peace of Christ to all of you, my big family. I really love you, and let us do more work. Today, we will speak about amazing prophecy made by the most amazing prophet in the world. And I'm sure the second I say the most amazing prophet, all of you know, I'm talking about who? I'm talking about Julius uh, Caesar. I mean, uh, sorry, uh, the prophet Muhammad. The prophet Muhammad... <clears throat> Always, I mix between them. I don't know what the reason, really. I'm not really. I'm not really sure. Uh, I think I'm not sure. But anyway, things happen. Yeah. So today, our topic about the Prophet Muhammad, who made amazing prophecy about the Roman, show respect please. I mean, come on. You people, you are just looking for a laugh. Unbelievable. So the Prophet Muhammad, one of the things amazing about him, he is the same as the rest of the Abdul. He cannot stop talking. And you know, when you are a foolish man, the more you talk, the more you do poo, -poo. I can bring a crazy person, address him, put a tie around his neck, Make him wear glasses, give him a Samsonite bag, and I will make you believe that he have a person who have 10 BHD and he is Einstein, as long as he don't talk. The second he talk, it is the same second he do poo-poo. And the Prophet Muhammad was really perfectly prophet unless he don't speak. I mean, don't let him talk. The second he talk, the same second he do poo-poo. So let us see the prophecy of Muhammad today. Uh, <clears throat> before we go to the prophecy about Muhammad today, there's a Abdul he posed for me uh, saying to me, Why you did not show the hadith number in the previous video? Don't forget, please, to watch it about Muhammad, amazing prophecy about high buildings. He said, What the problem there? And where is the hadith number? My friend, the hadith number is in front of you. This is Sahih al Bukhari. And if you don't see what the problem here, I mean, in this story here, there's many st stupid story. You can watch the previous video. I don't want to go back to zero. But did you notice here that your God, he said that he is the one who sent the rain. And supposedly he is the one who knows when the rain will come. And he is the only one who knows what is inside the womb. Today, Allah, like he changed his name. He became an X-ray machine. <laughs> so why you are asking me, What's the problem? Anyway, I, I, I advise you to go and watch the video from the beginning. Or your, pro, or your prophet saying that sign of judgment day when a slave woman gave birth to her mistress. <laughs> Is it Muhammad himself? Supposedly, according to you Muslims, he had sex with his slave Mary the Copt and he, she gave birth to him. Is it Abraham? He have Ishmael from his slave girl. Isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't it? We, there's millions of people they have that, especially in the, in the old days. So what is this? A sign of uh, this is sign of judgment day. I mean, this is extremely smart. <laughs> now, Muhammad, shut up, please. Show respect. Muhammad he made more poo, poo Let us see this one. This one it's about the Roman. Allah Messenger said, "The last hour would come when." the Roman would form a majority amongst the people, which means mankind. By the way, this is true. <laughs> yeah. I was calculating the population of the Roman Empire just two months ago. And I noticed that they are beating China, and they are beating... Uh, even they are more than the... Show respect. Even they are more that the, the Roman today, they are more the population of Italy. <laughs> uh, somebody saying Nas, not mankind. My friend, the Nas is uh, isn't it your God in the Quran? Let me teach you, teach me your religion. The word in the Quran for people is Nas. Uzubi Rabbi Nas. My friend, don't play the game. Don't 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 try to outsmart me. I'm Christian Prince. You don't know who I am. 
I get scared from debating myself. Look what this Abdul said to me. He did not say people, he said Nas. Nas? What Nas mean? Let us go to the Quran. Hmm? Isn't it him who keeps saying an Nas, an Nas, an Nas, at Nas, which means he is the, 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 the uh, 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 you know? Oh, people. Who, what people he's talking to? Only one person? All mankind. Isn't it who? Is it him who say Rabbu Nas? I like the Khannas. I like it when a Muslim he died, tried to outsmart me. That's really hurt my feeling. Chapter 114, verse number 4. Hmm? And 1, uh, uh, 114, 3, and 4, etc. So if we go here, where is the word Anas? Is that few people or he is the Lord of all, all mankind? Verse number three says, Ilahunnas. What Ilahunnas mean? So don't tell me Nas does not mean all mankind. It does. Read it with me and laugh, brother. Do you see it? This is the word Nas translated by you as mankind. Thank you very much. Brother Sister, the word there. Christian Prince, he always fabricate a lie. First of all, the hadith does not say all mankind. It says the word nas. And the word nas, brother, if you go to the dictionary, you will find that those are the people who they are certain group. What? The Quran say the word nas all over. And the nas always come in the Quran as he is the Lord of all mankind. Unbelievable. I mean, here we go. I must time in the chat, he did get me busted, but I can do. I feel sorry for myself. I'm going to retire. I'm going to retire. I'm going to buy a land in the Roman, uh, uh, the majority Roman uh, uh, country. Hmm. I'm sure the Chinese is wondering where is the Roman Empire exists now? There is no Roman no more. What Roman? Your prophet here is making a prophecy or he is making poo poo. Can somebody tell me where we can find the Roman? What Roman? Hello? Is that Romania? It might be Romania. <laughs> brother, brother, the prophet obviously is telling the truth. It is, it is happening. It's happening. The Roman became the majority. As an example, right now, from every five human being, there is seven people are Roman. <laughs> True. I mean, it's obvious. So if you are telling me the prophet is not telling a prophecy, I mean, you must be crazy. You must be really crazy and you are disconnected with reality. Actually, I heard, I heard that... Uh, uh, <clears throat> Uh, the the, uh, the the emperor of Japan, he is a Roman too. <laughs> Maybe. <coughs> Guys, come on. What's wrong with you? You keep laughing for any reason. I mean, show respect. Those people are weird. It's like Oprah show. You know, it's like the Muslim. They say takbir. It doesn't matter what they hear. Take, take a beer. I don't know. Maybe Muhammad, he meant uh, <clears throat> the American, that they are uh, the Roman, maybe. And maybe he meant by that, when he said the Roman, he meant uh, Obama. I'm just trying to find out the Roman, you know, I mean, don't blame me. Put yourself in my Roman shoes. Hmm? What Roman? What kind of a prophet he says such a thing? My friend, Abdul, I love you. I truly, 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 I love you. And I believe your original brother is the most entertaining religion brother. It's very funny and it's very unique. And brother, I decided to convert to Islam because I just discovered that the majority of mankind today, and uh, they are the Roman, even though we cannot find the Roman no more. Brother, 
how the prophet he knew all this information brother obviously if the prophet is not the prophet of god he will not get those information brother unless he is really truly truly prophet brother and if you don't believe me brother ask the prophet uh, zakarnaik he have more information brother my friend when i say islam is stupid i'm not insulting why the muslims don't question the stupidity of this Why nobody knows? I mean, why nobody is asking? For those, for the one who is saying he want to challenge me, I will be after uh, at three thirty, which means like twenty minutes from now, we will be live again. This is just a snack. So any Abdul, he have the courage and the knowledge to call me. Please feel free, and let us challenge the Roman, because uh, I did not tell you I'm not an Arab. I am a Roman. <laughs> No way. I always do I said myself <laughs> Muhammad the Prophet of Allah he received his information from where is that uh, hmm. I think I think I think the Prophet Muhammad he was watching Oprah show Oprah show before you leave a man while you are scared to debate CP guys a, a Somalian boy is saying to me why you are scared to debate CV I said I just said to you I will be here at 3 30 after 20 minutes from now actually that less 18 minutes I will have my Skype open call me and let us laugh let us see who is scared hmm? do you dare even to call me call me so we can laugh my friend you do not need to prove a prophet to be false prophet by studying many books if he, he said one thing is not true it means he's false let us say I said 20 things 20 things and 15 of them turned to be right but there is five of them turned to be a lie that's that's it I'm gone I cannot claim to be a prophet Muhammad is not a prophet and the proof in the front of you if you want to live in denial this is your business there is no Roman Empire and the Roman are not the majority of people and the Roman Empire is gone long time ago you're a prophet he thought he never thought that such a huge Empire is going to disappear he thought is going to stay until judgment day because he's a false prophet so he's making assumption based on what they are at that time that they are big huge powerful and then they will be the majority and by the way uh, the Muslim they say to us that Islam dominating the world well based on this hadith the Roman are dominating the world <laughs> brother a brother which one is going to dominate the world the brother the Roman or the Muslims brother think about it and guys I will be back with you after less than 15 minutes from now I will create the new uh, live broadcast is going to be called I will call it what I will call it the reason 10 reasons Muhammad is the true prophet of God so be with me after 15 minutes and my Skype will be open if you are a Muslim Abdul have the courage and the knowledge feel free to call me thank you very much guys and see you very soon again take care and this is a Christian Prince saying to you hello from the land of the Roman thank you <laughs>